It's me, LaShonda Brown. Welcome back to another segment. This particular segment is going to be on thermal pressing for the Mississippi State Board of Cosmetology Practical Examination for Cosmetologists. So, as you can see, I have all of my implements set up. For this particular service, you may choose to use a flat iron or you may choose to use a conventional pressing cone with the stove. I have selected the flat iron. Okay? I have all of my general bag items still set up, my soil implements container, my trash bag. I've also laid out the implements that I need for this service, which are heat resistant cones, my flat iron, and some white tissue paper to test my iron. For this particular skill, they are looking for you to drape properly. And as you can see, I have my proper drape on using a cloth cape, okay? As you go through this service, make sure you test the temperature of your flat iron each time before allowing the iron to touch the hair, okay? You need to make sure that your subsections are uniform, okay? So all you're going to do is make sure that the area that you're going to press, make sure if you're using a conventional pressing cone, make sure you're using the back of the cone, okay? We're going to be utilizing the three curls that we just executed when we did the thermal curls. This is the same area you're going to press. You have 15 minutes to complete this section. So take your time, make sure it's free from any ridges, and execute within the 15 minutes. So I'm going to remove these clips. I'm going to take my heat resistant comb and I'm just going to comb through those curls. Starting at the bottom of that, this section that we did the curls on, I'm going to take about a 1 8 to 1 4 inch subsection, part it off. I'm going to use one of the, I'm going to take a clip and clip the other hair out of the way. Okay, so this is going to be my first subsection. And as I move up this section, all of my other subsections should be the same diameter. Okay, so I'm going to test my iron on my white tissue paper. Then I'm going to execute. Okay, I'm going to make one smooth pass straight down. Okay. I'm going to lay my iron to the side and move to my next section. I am not going to comb that section because if you comb the hair while it's hot, it's going to freeze. So keeping my subsections the same, picking up my iron again, testing it, making sure it's not too hot, placing it on the hair. One pass. Okay, then I'm going to continue throughout that section, making sure my subsections are the same. Test my iron each time. by testing 
your flat iron each time. This is going to be my last subsection. Okay. And just like that, you're done. You have completely, we have completed the thermal press. Now, when I lifted the hair up, I noticed I have a little curl left right there. So what am I going to do? I'm going to pick that same subsection back up, comb it out, test my iron, and just give it another pass to ensure that all of the hairs are straight. Once the examiner has come over to evaluate your service, you're now ready to clean up, sanitize your hands, and set up for your next segment. Thank you for joining me for another segment of the practical procedures for the Mississippi State Board of Cosmetology Practical Exam for Cosmetologists. I'm LaShonda Brown. See you soon in another video on a screen near you.